Hey, what's going on world? If you're watching this, then you're obviously aware that there's something called raw veganism. You might not know exactly what it looks like. You might not know exactly what it entails, but essentially it consists of hopefully a diet. Oh my God, comprised of whole, sweet, fresh, ripe, raw, juicy fruit. If you're eating a diet comprised of sweet, whole, fresh, ripe, raw, juicy fruit, locally grown, in season, you're going to feel absolutely amazing. You may even be brought to tears with how good you feel naturally, drug-free. When you eat in line with nature's design, you'll eat from the vine and feel divine. It works every time. This is the diet that humans are designed to eat. We are not designed to eat anything else really but fruit. We can eat other stuff, sure. We can eat roots and tubers. We can eat leafy greens. We can eat vegetables. We can eat dead animals. We can eat metal. There is a guy in the Guinness Book of World Records who ate an entire plane. He would eat this. Oh God. Ah, so there's a way I could eat this guy. That really hurt my tooth. Fruit will never hurt your teeth. Ah, oh, goddamn. <laughs> oh, instant, like, did it chip my tooth? No, okay, uh, maybe it did. I hope not, it hurts. But, ah, there's no way you're gonna chip your tooth on a cantaloupe. There's no way you're gonna chip your tooth on a banana. There's no way you're gonna chip your tooth on an orange or a grapefruit or an apple. Maybe if you're trying to eat the seeds, yeah, but not the this the sweet juicy flesh so I just want to put this video out there remind you guys to focus on the fruit when you focus on the fruit life is beaut in fact what's this say all you need is fruit that's right guys all you need is fruit so if you want to support the vegetarian movement the raw vegan movement if you want to be a part of the raw vegan movement if you want to experience what it feels like to feel this absolute connection with nature and to be surviving be thriving on nothing but raw living foods then I would suggest you come to a few festivals this summer I would suggest the Woodstock Fruit Festival that is by far the number one biggest fruit festival out there right now it's got over 600 attendees coming this summer it's gonna be effing sick man like I'm doing some video editing right now for a client he's gone to like Hangout Fest and Coachella and stuff but when you're at the Woodstock Fruit Festival it's drug free party time all the time it's like the Woodstock Love Festival everyone there is just like in love with each other it's amazing you're surrounded by your best friends at the Woodstock Fruit Festival even if you show up and you don't know anyone you're gonna meet the love of your life your best friends of your life and just connections for a lifetime so if you want to head hit up the Woodstock Fruit Festival check the link in, in the description also even before the Woodstock Fruit Festival which is in end of August if you want to come to the Danish Fresh Food Festival this will be like its 10th or 11th year running in a row it's an amazing fresh fresh food festival in uh, Denmark, Copenhagen, Denmark. That festival is amazing too, man. People I met there last year was just like, oh my God, how do you even exist? These people, like GTFO, man, like you're unreal. You're just so beautiful, so perfect, and um, so plentiful. So there's lots of amazing people at the Danish Fresh Food Festival in Copenhagen. That's like July 20th. And again, if you want to come to that festival, check the link in the description for more info on that. And if you want to come to the UK Fruit Festival, which is just like a week after that, in a, in a, I think it's, I think it's the uh, Croft, Crofton, Croft, Crofton Water Park or something. It's in the UK somewhere. For all the details, if you're in England and you want to come to the woods, the UK Fruit Festival, check the link in the description as well. Um, and I'll see you guys there. You're gonna learn so much, you're gonna experience so much that whatever it costs you to get there, whatever it costs you to attend, it will be worth it tenfold. I'm 26 years old now. I started going to these festivals when I was like 21. And whew, the examples that get set there, man, the role models that are there showing you what it's like, what your life can be like in 10 years time if you just stay the course, if you just continue to eat raw, if you focus on the fruit, your life can be amazing and there's living examples at these festivals. So I uh, highly suggest coming. And even if you don't wanna to go to these festivals but you wanna meet up with people in your area, then just go on meetup.com, create a meetup group or create a Facebook event. I'm gonna be doing that soon here in Vancouver, Canada. The weather is looking gorgeous. Just look at it. It's perfect. So definitely gonna have a meetup here soon in Vancouver, Canada. If you guys are in for that, post a link in the comment or post a link in the comment just post a comment down below saying you're in for that and uh, I'll be stoked to meet you there 
Other than that, guys, I'm going to head out. You guys don't have much time, so go enjoy yourself. Peace out.